welcome back. Guess what? I came here to pick up a new ship. I'm so excited. Um, a viewer contacted me, uh, Eve Player, before my birthday and uh, said that he had a ship that he'd like to give me and uh, to take very good care of it. So he asked where he could meet me to give it to me. And um, I picked out Dixie and he said, that's fine. Let's take a peek. Can you guess what it is? I'm only going to show you a little bit. Okay, that's enough. And now we're going to undock. Uh, so I came out here. Like I said, this was, you know, b before my birthday. And, uh, and saw it and just drooled. Oh, so, ooh, you know, geeky moment. And, um, you know, he told me to take very good care of it. I can't remember if he said that it was okay to say his name. Uh, I will say Jack. And if it's okay, I'm going to send him the video. If he says it's okay, then I'll anno annotate it. Um, and add it to the comment section below. But, um, gosh. D see, this ship looks fierce. See, like, a Dominix looks like a shoe. You're not really intimidated by a Dominix. You know what I mean? But this looks like bad assery right here. Bad assery. Oh, this ship looks good. I love it. I absolutely love it. Ugh. And, um, yeah, CCP did a really, really good job with this. Oop, new animation. The one thing that I really like about this is that the traveling time, I've noticed, is so much faster. It, it definitely makes a difference. At least to me, it makes a difference. So, uh, one thing that I want to talk about is we gaze at the beauty of the ship while I get it somewhere safe. Is uh, Oh, the reason why I didn't do this earlier is because Goon and Test have been having a war. And even though I'm in high sec, um, you can't see the... It's not the emblem. There's something that's close to the curve on the front of this that hopefully when the light changes you can see better but anyway um i've been getting time dilation in high sec with this war going on in no so that's why i kind of waited until i thought it was safe when i wasn't getting time dilation that would suck if i needed to move and couldn't move so anyway there was another topic that i wanted to talk about real quick and that is multi-boxing i mentioned about WoW and how the multi-boxers have inspired me and then I found out that oh there it is slick um IX IS boxer is compatible with Eve which is what they're using in WoW and Rift and Neverwinter and quite a few other games so I have IS boxer and I've been messing around with it in WoW to see how it worked now I did contact uh, CTP to ask them if the software was okay. And they responded quickly to say that they don't endorse any third-party software. And the reason why is because if they endorse it today, the software developer could put something in the software that would make it against the terms of service um, the next day, a week from now, a week, a uh, year from now, a month from now, you know what I'm saying? So, they don't endorse any um, third-party software. Now, playing with the software, um, I don't see how it's uh, against the terms of service because they they linked me to an article on the forums where a post from a dev where they said that clicking a button and it going across multiple clients is not against the service automation is against the terms of service where you can walk away from your computer and the computer is acting like you're still there this software does not do that um, and if it has a capability of doing it the software itself doesn't have it the person is adding it to it they're like reverse engineering or adding something to it so the software itself I think is fine but what I'm going to do is I'm going to play with it in WoW uh, where death is cheap and um, 
I'm gonna mess around with it in in Rift. God, this ship looks good. Thank you so much. Um, I'm gonna play around with it in in Rift because Rift went free to play today, and uh, Neverwinter and other places to get to understand the mechanics. Um, multiboxing is not new to me, but I didn't use this software. And this software, although more sophisticated and easier, like being able to to swap between screens very easily. Um, it's easy once you get it, but I had a lot of um, baggage from, I found that the software, the, I rephrase, I remembered the name of the software that I used to use, Key Clone, and I have no idea what it's doing now. I don't even think, I don't even know if it's being updated. I have no interest in it, but um, <laughs> it, things have advanced greatly since I last multiboxed. So, so many people in, in EVE have multiple accounts. Do you multibox? Let me know. I'm curious. And I will see you guys in the next one.